There is no reason why Donald Trump should be considered any more. I mean, he's a personally, he's a buffoon, of course. But I'm sorry, Mike Huckabee, he's also a buffoon. Ted Cruz, a buffoon. Scott Walker, have you ever heard that call when he got pranked and he thought he was talking to the Koch brothers? Buffoons. Completely unqualified. Why is Donald Trump any less qualified or more ridiculous than the idea of Carly Fiorina running for president or Ben Carson, for God's sakes? I mean, it goes on and on. Uh, Donald Trump immediately is in the top quarter of the Republican uh, uh, candidates in terms of intellectual power, in terms of policy understanding, in terms of not saying insane things. Like, I'm sorry, Benghazi? I mean, has anybody heard Lindsey Graham talk about we're living in the most threatening age of uh, the... What? Republican candidates come out and say ridiculous things every single day. And because Donald Trump had a reality show... This party worships a guy who, who had an entire career pretending to be a hero and working with monkeys. Ronald Reagan, anybody? I mean, what is it that's so disqualifying about Donald Trump as a Republican candidate? I would submit to you nothing. I mean, let's listen to Donald Trump's immigration uh, stance and tell me if this is different or in any way out of touch with what the vast majority of Republicans want in poll after poll, or what most of the Republican leadership has been saying for years. So, just to sum up, I would do various things very quickly. I would repeal and replace the big lie Obamacare. Pause it. How is that different? The, the, the Republican Congress took 55 votes to repeal Obamacare. Continue. I would build a great wall, and nobody builds walls better than me, believe me. And I'll build them very inexpensively. I will build a great, great wall on our southern border, and I will have Mexico pay for that wall. Yeah. Mark my words. Yeah. Pause it. I'm sorry. Yeah. How, is that, how is that in any way distinguishable from what the Republican Party has been demanding for years? For years. Continue. Nobody would be tougher on ISIS than Donald Trump. Nobody. Pause it. How's that different from what Lindsey Graham or Rick Perry has been talking about? Is it? Is it? Is it? I mean, honestly, I, I mean, if think anything, Donald Trump may understand ISIS better than it's guys. very possible. Continue. I will find within our military. I will find the General Patton, or I will find. General MacArthur, I will find the right guy. I will find the guy that's going to take that military and make it really work. Nobody, nobody will be pushing us around. Pause it. How's that different than what Jeb Bush said in his announcement, right, about the military being uh, problematic? Okay, so he doesn't know it's MacArthur, not MacArthur. It doesn't matter. <laughs> because maybe the next MacArthur will be named MacArthur. That's p possible. Continue. I will stop Iran from getting nuclear weapons, and we won't be using a man like Secretary Kerry that has absolutely no concept of negotiation, who's making a horrible and laughable deal, who's just being tapped along as they make weapons right now, and then goes into a bicycle race at 72 years old, and falls and breaks his leg. I won't be doing that. And I promise I will never be in a bicycle race. That I can tell you. Pause it. All right. Well, yeah, the bicycle race thing aside, he's actually got a good point about that. But everything else he said there, how is that any different from what John McCain says on a daily basis on, uh, or every Sunday? How is that any different from what the entire Republican Party has been saying? I mean, there's nothing... Donald Trump is saying that isn't completely aligned with the Republican Party. Continue. 
I can pause it. I mean, except for the bicycle thing. Like, that seems to be gratuitous. But go ahead. I will immediately terminate President Obama's illegal executive order on immigration. Immediately. Pause it. Every Republican candidate, I think, has said that. Right? Continue. Fully support and back up the Second Amendment. I mean, is there anything that Donald Trump has just said, aside from, like, focusing in on the bicycle race, <laughs> that is not mainstream Republican values? I don't think so. I don't think so. And look, he's polling better than, like, 10 of them. This guy could be our next Republican nominee. That's all I'm saying.